Hey, what's up, guys? This video is about this pipe. I will place the part number in a minute. That pipe is that one right there. You can see it's black. It's got a little bit of black smoke in there. Um, it's broken. That pipe right there, this one right there, they, they want 580 something dollars in one dealer and 660 something in the other dealer. So I ordered this is us to market. It came with two gaskets. And the best thing, look, it came with two clamps, buddy. So that's good. Um, and that's the pipe right there you see now let's hope it fits so I'm gonna be taking that apart in order to work very comfortable what I did last time was is I took this el this uh, thing right here elbow whatever you call I took them both out uh, to um, what happened was the pipe was leaking exhaust hot air there's a computer as part of the DEF thing there so I didn't want the heat hitting the computer so I turned the pipe around so in order for me to do that I had to remove this out so I can get to the bolt it looks a lot smaller but I don't care about the thickness be honest with you because if you look at it inside it's the same size of that what I do care is is about I do care make sure it's big enough and big enough so there you go this is four and a half four and a half so I do care about that that's what it must most important thing and plus this is you know you can pull it out so I'm gonna install that and the best thing is if you got somebody who can weld they can cut these things off these things and make a pipe because that's all it is I pay three hundred dollars Okay, I got one side in. It's not easy holding the phone and um, holding, uh, trying to put that clamp on it. Three hands is good, but unfortunately, uh, don't have three hands right now, so I only got two. So, um, but I just got to put the other gasket. It goes in there and put the new clamps on that and see what happens. It's not on there yet, but just wanted to let you know. See? So I just got to clamp it. And try it out. See what happens. Hopefully I don't get a check engine light. Since all these trucks you do, you get a check engine light. It's unbelievable. Six hundred dollars for that little pipe. This is off the market, so let's see how that holds. This is the worst sometimes when you have somebody to do this kind of clamps. I mean, they will they put my clamps up and down, and it was hard to get them. So there is the pipe. So uh, hopefully it will work. Okay, for this next ones, what I'm gonna do is I they steal the gasket in there. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna go ahead and get some new gaskets, and probably new clamps, so I don't take a chance that it will be leaking because with this stuff right here, you can't mess around, man. Here's the part number for that particular pipe now this is for a can work it could be the same for a Peterbilt or other trucks 
but this is Kenworth part number and this is what the original part is basically it's another it's two pipes one inside in this coil pipe or however you want to call it that don't make no sense but when you order it make sure that the size matches you know when you get it make sure that you measure there and the same because I was this thing looked bigger than the other one so but that one is the other one is us to market so just make sure you do your own homework with the part numbers here's all the part numbers the two tops are ours to market and the bottom one that is the Kenworth original part I believe thanks for watching